she was of the Shirley Temple era, but my parents could not afford a Shirley Temple doll for three of us girls. So um, I ended up with her, but she's absolutely adorable. And um, that's all about her, I guess. I don't think these are the original clothes. I'm quite sure that I ordered different clothes, and I'm not sure. I think I changed her hair. <laughs> <laughs> but her eyes open, and she's teeth. Um, this is my mother's birth certificate, 1905. She was born in Lower Mackinac uh, Township, Northumberland County. Um, she, her name was Wolf, but she's, her grandparent, her grandmother was, um, a Latchaw, which is, you know, well-known name. This is a picture of my father's school, um, 1911. Um, he was born in... New Buffalo Township, Perry County, and the name of the school is Fairmount 1911 Hubler School, and the teacher was Hiram Walter, but so far nobody has been able to locate this school for me. So, and last but not least is A Bible belonging to Jacob Eichholz. He was one of the proprietors of the Northumberland County Democrat, the first new paid newspaper in Sunbury. In 1871, he was the sole proprietor. Later on, when he died, his son, uh, William Eichholz, and that's whose Bible this is. Um, and later on, uh, the Dewarts owned the Sunbury Daily Item.